everybody it is December 19th it is me again from uh, outdoors life today I'm at bluffers park again but this time I'm up at the top there's a big field here lots of field that I'm gonna detect today today I'm gonna do something different today I am going to dig up my targets and try not to see what it is uh, I'm gonna put it into a bag uh, with little dirt as possible of course and I'm gonna take it all home uh, my daughter has gotten me a gold panning set with a classifier I'm real excited to use it it's a little cold for me to get out uh, into the woods now and use that so I'm gonna use it for this purpose and I'm gonna pan out all the finds um, through the classifier and whatnot and uh, anything good comes up or anything you know of course we're gonna catch the footage of the coins and whatnot what, what pop up but I'm gonna for the most part try not to see what's coming out of the ground until we get back and then we'll We'll do a, a, a real quick uh, pan of everything and see what we got today. All right, so I'm going to get on it right now. We got our first target here. Got it out of the hole. Do not know what it is. We're just going to throw it right into this bag. As I said in the beginning of the video. And we'll just pan it all out later. All right, let's get on to the next. All right, got the next target. Right here, number two. In my head. Sounds okay. Going right into the bag, not even gonna look. Right into the bag and on to the next. Alright, target number three in my hand. And right into the bag it'll go. Probably fit about a hundred targets in here. I'm pretty pumped to get home and check it out. But let's get on and fill this hole and get on to some more. Another target number four. Very faint, not sure, but it's in my hand. So we're just gonna go ahead and throw it in the bag until we get home and on to the next we get. Another target going in the bag. That's about four or five now. I can fit a lot more in there. Kind of curious to be honest, but we'll see how it pans out later. <laughs> on to the next we get. Well, we've got three targets in one spot here. Right away, I see in the surface fine. 10 cents. I'm just going to go ahead and throw it in the bag, sweeten it up. And I got two more targets here marked out. I'm just trying to dig them out at the same time. Don't think it's going to be too deep. So, shall see. see what we can do there. We got them. So here's the fun part, trying not to see what it is. So, just take a little piece off. All right, we got one in there. Nothing there. Nothing, still in there. Still something in there. All right, try and get down to as small as possible. All right, two more targets in the bag. If, uh, I'm gonna go over this area. If I get any more targets, I'll mark them out the same way and uh, dig them live for you. We skipped a couple targets. Just threw them in the bag. Got another one here. Oh, what's going on? Oh, you turn it off? No. No? Not picking it up. Oh, it's in there. We're just gonna bring that whole little chunk with me. All right, we got some more beeps here. If we, uh, once we pull them up, we'll get a camera on. On to the next. All right, and another surface find. Right there, 25 cents. But there is more targets right here. I'm gonna assume it's a coin, and I'm just gonna scrape off the top layer because that one wasn't too deep. And we'll just see. We'll see if we can. Uh, not see this target and get it in the bag. Let's hopefully we get it in there as I expected. Oh, right here, there we go. Bag sir. In the bag it goes. Make sure no notes in there. Alright, let's check this area a bit more. Put all that coin in there. And uh, we'll get back to it. 
and another find just close to those last two quarters. And there it is, and it will go in the bag. All right, let's get some more. And another target going into the bag. Let's find it here. Trying to bring home as less dirt as possible. Whatever comes out of this is what it'll be. In the bag. Now on to the next. And we've got another target. Wherever it went. Right there. And we're gonna put her right in the no pros bag with the rest of it. Beauty. And we're gonna go get more as you know. On to the next. All right, this one here, finally got it. <coughs> you can see it's a, a nickel, so five cents. Uh, we're gonna get onto some more right now. We're gonna be losing light soon. We'll just throw that in the bag as well. All right, on to the next. Got another target here to throw into the bag. Right there, boom, skitty, gone. We got a boat. Quarter a bag of targets so far. I haven't been recording them all. Could be way too much footage. But I am gonna record as many as I can and then sift through them and see if I can get a nice video together for you with all of these finds. Let's get on to some more. Another one. Oh, did you see that? Tell me you got that. I pulled it apart and shook it and change dropped right out of it. So unfortunately, we're not gonna be able to put it in there, but fortunately, that is the first loony of the day right there. That looks like a loony and a dime. Fell right out of that chunk. Hey, hey, hey we're gonna throw it in the bag. You know you got something good to look, to look forward to so far. So we pan it out later. And we're gonna get on more coin spills. I believe that's three coin spills so far. So, great, we're gonna hit this area real hard. And we'll get back to you as soon as we get some more. More targets and more targets in this area. So it almost feels like a metal detector in a schoolyard. Target, 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 right there. Break it down some. My wife don't give me trouble, but bringing too much stuff home, I believe the target is in there. In the bag it goes. Patch up the hole and on to the next. This here sounds like a coin spill. Just in case they fall out again, I want to make sure I catch it. I could be wrong as well, but crazy signal all over the place. No, we didn't get it there. Not in there either. Let me let you hear what I'm hearing. Crazy there, crazy there, a little bit there. I think I just missed the side. I'm thinking it's more in there. And it's in there. Unfortunately, I don't see it, so you're not going to see it until it goes in the pan. But, let me concentrate down. There it is. Into the bag it goes. All right, we'll get on to some more and we'll get back to you. We're digging up here. Sounds like another target for the bag. How's that bag? Getting heavy? Yep. Is it a good idea to do this? Yep. I've been pretty pumped, more pumped the whole time than I normally am. I really don't know what I have in that bag. That ring I could have been looking for the last 10 trips, I might have found two or three already. Maybe none. So let's get back onto it. Lots of beasts to dig. Got another another signal here. Going right into the bag. And I believe that there was another strong signal just over that way. So let's get this buried up and we'll kick this one for you. The ground's actually super soft today. The other day was frozen like ice. Fully taking advantage of the situation. Not trying to go home. We got it in the plug. Break off. Okay. Hey, how's it going? Sorry, just making a video. 
Pretty good. <laughs> How's it going? Find anything interesting? Uh, change. I dropped a bunch of loonies over there. Where's that at? <laughs> uh, just over by the fence there where you first climb over. Oh, really? Yeah, I moved a bunch of leaves. I just. Uh... <laughs> well, maybe we'll find it if we get over that way. Never know. <laughs> Only loonies, but yeah, you yeah, know. Yeah, it all adds up, right? Might find something else. There's a. Uh, People are climbing over there, they drop stuff out of their pockets, eh? What is it? I don't know what that is. Is, is it, it 10 cents? It's really old looking. No, it's uh. Hold it. Have fun. Thank you. Another signal. And the bag it goes. Back up nice. And we'll get some more. Alright, so we've got another hole here. I can actually see the coin, which is a quarter. So we're going to throw that in the bag. Double check. Still more in there. So here we'll try to here we'll try to do what we've been doing. Not see what other kind of coin is in there. I hear, I hear something there. Throw it in the bag. Let's double check. Check, double check. Looks so like we might have some more inside of here. Possible coins right there. And we're going to clean up these holes and we'll get back to you with some more. All right, so we are home. And as I said, I've taken all the dirt and I've metal detected everything right down to the finest. Well, the lighting's not good in here, but uh, there it is. Now, Here's the pan, I'm gonna pan it down as if it was gold. See what happens to it. Basically what I'm doing, if you don't know, is shaking it so all the heavy materials go to the bottom of the pan. We're letting out all the light sands on the top, just kind of cleaning it out until you get down to the heavier stuff. If there's any gold, that'd be nice. It's a lot of, a lot of light. Take a minute. Shake down. Wash off anything like loose off the top and junk stuff. I can see a couple things in there. A couple trash. It is possible that I'm losing stuff over the top of the pan and into this bucket, which is why I got the bucket here as well. Plus, I don't want to put dirt in my drain. Like, but not like that. see so far I'm just gonna pull them out of the pan just some aluminum tap stuff here looks like another aluminum juice tap thing here and here is two pull tabs all right we'll wash it down a little more a lot more probably give me a shimmy shake Stuff 
watch it off a bit more. It's thick. That's if you watch the, the beginning of the video and all, you'll see I was just taking little bunches of dirt. So it's a lot to go through. But I thought it'd be a little bit more interesting to go through it like this and be surprised in the end, if anything, right? Just adds to the surprise. It's already surprised when you pull it out of the ground. Oh, look at that. Hold on. Let's see if I can get that still floating around in there. I'm just going to pull it out of the pan to show you easier. Well, he's no good. That is one big old earring. I'll get a better shot of all this stuff right after in the light, but nice. I'll put that right there for now. Keep going. Hey, that's jewelry. Love it. That's two trips in a row, maybe three. I've actually gotten some jewelry. Pan this down. So I had to skip out on some of the pan in there. It was a really long process, but I picked out all the beer caps and stuff and just threw them in there. And you start to see now all the coin clad coming through on there. Look at that, that's so much better than just finding one coin at a time. So much better. I like how the ripples in the pan that are used to Catch the gold is actually catching the coins, showing its purpose. Just catch those heavier. We have it. Almost got it right clean there. Let's go all those sands out there. 
What do we got? Let's see. Alright, we got 25. That looks to be the old nickel. Another nickel. A dime. A washer. A loony. One dollar coin, Canadian coin. Another five cents. Quarter. Ten cents. Five cents. Penny. Quarter. Dime. Dime. Quarter. Nickel. 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 Dime. Nothing that looks old. That's not. I don't know what that is. That's not a penny or a dime. I'm not, I'm not sure what that is. That's not a Canadian coin. I don't think so. No, I can't even see what it is. I'll check it out and I'll post it in the comments below if anyone knows or... Oh, this says one cent on it. Well, I'm going to have to check that out anyhow. And uh, I'll post in the comments section below what that is. Because that's uh, probably the most interesting find here. That and this earring. Which with a quick inspection... Do I see stamp, stamp, stamp? No stamp, so I'm going to assume it's not silver, but we'll check it out anyhow. Alright, thanks for watching the video. Let me know if you enjoyed this type of uh, metal detecting slash panning. Uh, maybe I can get a better setup on the next time if uh, anyone wants to see another video like this. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and until next time, have a good one.